What's up, YouTube? Hey, Card Dreamer here. This Coming is to Card Dreamer. She's over here watching football. Believe it or not, she's watching the Dolphins and the uh, Buccaneers. Tampa Bay Buccaneer game. So she's got that going on right now. So uh, I wanted to bring to you guys uh, my first talk about um, retro vintage cards. So we're going to go over 1984, which was an amazing year for football cards. Uh, you had some great, great, great rookies during that year. Uh, rookies like John Elway, Marino, Howie Long, Eric Dickerson, uh, Tippett. Uh, so it's a lot of a lot of rookies that happened during that year. Uh, a lot of these guys are Hall of Famers now, um, and a lot of them are still getting inducted into the Hall of Fame. But we're going to kind of go through uh, my set. Uh, I am almost completed on this set. I have a total of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven more cards I need to do to complete this set. Uh, we'll talk about that as we go. Um, but let's just take a look at what we got going here. Uh, first card, of course, of the set right here is Eric Dickerson. Um, and then we have uh, Francisco Harris, uh, some awesome John Riggins. And we'll go to the next page there. Uh, and then we've got so we're going to hit to the Colts area, which the great thing about these cards, everything was based into the um, team that they were in. So that was that's awesome, actually. Uh, it makes things a lot more easy to get to. So we'll take a look here. Um, so right here is uh, Ray Donaldson, which was a rookie uh, during that time. And then we had uh, Chris... Uh, Hins was a rookie then. Uh, Vernon Maxwell was also a rookie at that time. Uh, some great Colts teams that were uh, in there. Uh, 84 was a very, uh, well, it was a very interesting year because uh, there was a lot of teams fighting for uh, the Super Bowl. And the Super Bowl uh, 20 is what it was. And the Bears beat the Patriots 46 to 10 that year. So that is uh, great for the Bears. It was their very first Super Bowl. Uh, it was great for the Patriots to lose. No, I'm just saying that, okay? So uh, just kind of give an eye through uh, Kenny Anderson, some great players that played back in there. Uh, Isaac Curtis. This will take you guys back to yesteryear. Ray Horton. Uh, we've got uh, Reggie Williams. Now we're into the Browns. Uh, Clay Matthews' father, uh, and then Ozzie Newsom, longtime Raven Browns connection, uh, Mike Pruitt, uh, John Elway rookie card right there, very awesome, and uh, more of the Denver Broncos that we're into right now. Uh, and then we hit into the Oilers, and uh, in the Oilers at that time. Uh, we had the rookie cards of Steve Brown, Chris Darlow, uh, Dress I'm sorry, Chris Dressel, uh, and also uh, Kemp, uh, Tim Smith, Willie Tillis. So we'll kind of look at these guys here. And then we get into the Kansas City Chiefs, and we had Mike Bell, rookies, uh, Cherry, and Gary Green and the Kansas City Chiefs. And then the next one is the Raiders. The Raiders. Uh, the Raiders, uh, back in those, had Lyle Azado. It wasn't his rookie year, but it's just a great card to have. Um, you also know that it had Howie Long, was one of the rookie cards that were there. That is one of the cards that I'm missing. The Howie Long rookie card right there. So that's one I have to uh, find. Um, I put my list up on the Facebook group and uh, a few guys said, hey, I have that card. If you need it, I'll send it to you, which is awesome. And then we go into the Dolphins. Uh, of course, you know, you have your um, Dan Marino rookie. That is another one that I'm missing, which is right there. Uh, it's another one of those ones that I got to try to find. Um, so with your Dolphins, you also had uh, Doug Betters. You had Mark Dupreau. Um, of course, the Dan Marino. You also had uh, Judson, rookie cards in there. Uh, then we had the Patriots. 
the people who lost this year, which they had a pretty stacked team back in those days. Uh, Tony Collins. They had Bob Sider. Um, Holloway were rookies. Rick Sanford. Uh, Andrew Tippett, which are which would your Patriots are. Then we went to the Jets for Sam. J E T S Jets is Jets, right, Sam? And back in those, um, there wasn't many rookies for the Jets. You had two, Pat Ryan and Kurt Springs. Those were your two Jets uh, rookies there. Uh, there's your Kurt Spring and your uh, Pat Ryan. Uh, and then we went into the Steelers. Yeah. Uh, Steelers didn't, they had a couple rookies, which were Keith Willis and Ricky Woods. Uh, but then you had your Terry Bradshaw. Uh, you had your uh, Francisco Harris, another Harris card, Jack Lambert, great players. Uh, Donnie Shell, Mike Weber. There's your Keith Williams and your Woods rookies. Uh, and then we had the Chargers. And uh, in the Chargers time, we had rookies like uh, Landon King, Billy Ray Smith, Danny Waters. Those were all rookies then. So there's is our Chargers. So we had uh, Billy Ray Smith, Danny Waters, uh, Kellen Winslow. Uh, let's see, and then we had our Seahawks. Of course, our Seahawks had great players, but rookies like uh, David. Uh, Craig uh, and Kurt Warner. So we'll take a look at the Seahawks here. And then I'm missing the one, the Kurt Warner. I mean, the Steve Largent card. That's one of the ones I'm missing. It's right here. The Steve Largent uh, card is missing there, which is, I already got it. Um, uh, Angel Hernandez, he hooked me up and said he had one. He'd like to send it to me, so that's cool. Um, so we go through our Seahawks. And we have our team leader cards. Uh, I am missing one of the team leader cards. So these are just some cards that I'm missing. There'll be a link to this, what I'm missing on the profile. Then your Atlanta Falcons, which, which is a good team that year. Um, you had a lot of a lot of players that were up and coming during that time. Uh, Stacy Bailey was the rookie. Uh, Ralph Gamero. Um, so these are your Atlanta Falcons. And then the Chicago Bears was you had Willie Galt. Uh, and Jim McMahon. Of course, you see I'm missing one right here, which is the Walter Payton regular. Walter Payton I'm missing. There's the Walter Payton instant replay. Uh, Mike Singletary. Then you have your Cowboys, which a lot of you Cowboy lovers. Tony Dorsett. Uh, Tony Hill. Too Tall Jones. Drew Pearson. I got to meet Drew Pearson. Um, you also have... Uh, now we're getting into our Lions for Eloy the Goat. Uh, big D for life for the shout outs for the Cowboys. Lions, Eloy the Goat. Uh, William Gay. James Jones. Ed Murray. Billy Sims, another Billy Sims. Then we go into the Green Bay Packers. Uh, there's also Gary Ellis. Tim Lewis, James Lofton. Uh, then we go into the Rams, which is Eric Dickerson. Another Eric Dickerson rookie card right there. We have Vince Kendall Hill, Jack Youngblood, the Vikings, Dustin and Blake, Dustin Abraham. Shout out to you, buddy. Uh, Ted Brown, Kramer, Richards, Jeff Turner. You'll see those couple I'm missing here which would be the Morton Anderson and the Ricky Jackson rookie. Those are the two that I'm missing there. Uh, that's into the Saints. Now we're into the Giants. And we have uh, Scott Berner, Ernest Gay. We've got Phil Sims, Lawrence Taylor, the original LT, uh, Brad Van Belt. 
Then we go into our eagles. Fly, eagles, fly. A Ron Joukowsky. Then we have our Cardinals, uh, AJG. Shout out to you, buddy. Uh, Otis Anderson, uh, David Galloway, Curtis. Then we got our 49ers, shout out to Cool Totes. Uh, Dwight Smith, Dwight Clark, Dwight Clark, uh, Roger Craig rookie, Ronnie Lott. Uh, I'm missing the Joe Montana. Toads. I'm missing the Joe Montana. I'm sure you have doubles of that Joe Montana. Toads. Um, another Joe Montana. Uh, Eric Wright. Then we got our Buccaneers, which I don't know anybody who's a Bucks fan except for guys at work. Uh, yeah, Donnie. James Owens. More Buccaneers. Jack Thompson. And then we got our Washington Redskins, Skins Defense, David Buzz, Art Monk, Dale, uh, Mark Murphy. And then we have uh, John Riggins, Joe Feisman, Joe Washington. And then we have our checklist. So that is the look into the 1984 uh, top set. It's a really great set. The value, the book value of it is like $150. Um, the eBay value to buy a completed set still in the range of about 98 to 100 bucks for an average set. As you see, this set is an actually pretty, I would say near mint to mint set right now. Um, they, I've just been very cautious on this particular set because it just means a lot to me. So uh, anyway, that is my look into 1984. My wife and I uh, are going to hang out tonight and just chill out. So that is our plans. Thanks for watching this nice 12 minute video and looking into the 1984. Peace, God bless, and happy collecting from the Card Dreamer.